welcome back ladies and gentlemen to bitcoin daily for another video today as you know on wednesdays we like to do the fan followers q and a's so today we're just jumping right into q and a's uh, i asked you guys yesterday to drop some questions um if you'd like to be, me to answer them and be featured in the video and today i am dropping some knowledge so let's jump right in let me swap my face out the way as you guys know, I love forgetting to do it. Boom, there we go. Put my beautiful face right up there. And let's jump right into these questions. So the first one is from Krishna Sai, or Krishna Sai. Um, this person with this pretty cool mask here. Uh, what is that from, uh, Spider-Man? What's, what's, what's it called? Uh, I can't think of the name right now. Or is that like a some sort of sound looking thing. I don't know, but pretty cool mask, pretty cool mask. I like to know that you're keeping it safe with your uh, with the corona and not spreading it. So appreciate you, Krishna. Um, so the first question is, I literally have no knowledge about Bitcoin. Can you help me out? Um, so Krishna, lucky for you, I can help you out because I've dropped videos on exactly what to do if you're new and lucky for you i'm about to put it for you right here i'm about to show you exactly where it is just go to so this is the easiest way to do it i'm gonna do it with you guys bitcoin whoops on on youtube go to bitcoin daily right boom well, you're, you're already on the page. If, if you're watching it, you already found my page. But just in case, for Krishna, you see this right here? So you put that. Forget this guy. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Right here. Boom. Bitcoin Daily. I don't know who these people are posting all these random stuff. But forget them. Just forget them. Look at these guys. Nope. Not them. Bitcoin Daily. Boom. Then, click Videos. Right? Boom right 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 now all you got to do is scroll right here see this one says top 10 bitcoin questions answered bitcoin for dummies aka beginners um posted it up three weeks ago so this is very new um where i answer all the most common questions that you could ever have when you're getting started um and that's basically gonna get you started gonna put you in the right direction and if you want more then you can click right here bitcoin university see where it says bitcoin university if you just go right there to that page you'll see you'll see this you just scroll down right here see where it says bitcoin university you just click that and if you scroll down you can enroll into this course for only ten dollars and look at all this knowledge i dropped Look at this, the course curriculum. Like, I drop a lot, a lots of knowledge here about exactly how Bitcoin works and how you can get started. Um, so that is what I recommend for you, my guy. All right. Hopefully, I answered that question sufficiently. Um, and now let's get back to the next question. Appreciate your question, my guy. Let's go to the next one, Fernando. Uh, Fernando Icaputra, Icaputra, I hope I said that right. Fernando's out here snowboarding. What? That's my favorite thing to do, man, during the winter. I went snowboarding in January. It was so fun, man, busted my ass, but I had a great time doing it. So, um, he asked, why Outcoin is bleeding so hard right now? Um, well, Fernando, the reason why, and again, I don't know what outcoin you're specifically looking at um because outcoins aren't doing too bad right now i'm trying to find i know i have it open somewhere do i i guess not um but if we just jump over to trading view real quick this is where i where i look at my charts see if i could sign if it signs me in here we go. So if we look at the charts real quick, or actually, you know, where, where you can get even a better grasp 
coinmarketcap.com you can see exactly what's been going on the last 24 hours and you'll see Bitcoin is up right now 1.64 percent Ethereum's flat um, everything else is pretty much flat polka dot down four and a half percent chain link down seven percent chain link was very high if you see my other videos and analysis on chain leak uh, I gave you guys some numbers to enter um, everything else is pretty flat there's nothing too crazy um, you know anything that's going down a lot it's probably because it went up a lot you know what I mean um, so everything is is pretty flat today in the last few days and also the reason why is uh, the reason why altcoins usually are moving around is due to um, Bitcoin Bitcoin is what runs it all Bitcoin is the king of this market uh, altcoins do, do what Bitcoin says and Bitcoin said go down so everything went down it said stay flat everything kind of stay flat and then it says go up everything goes up so usually when Bitcoin's moving a lot altcoins might might stay flat or um, or go down a little bit and then they'll catch up later on um, so uh, not too much to worry about there depending on which altcoins you're talking about since you were just kind of very broad with that but uh, I appreciate your question Fernando uh, Zay Babas 11 when will you give giveaways so actually is a babas with this amazing photo and filter i don't know what's behind you there but that looks pretty cool too looks like some sort of balloons or something i don't know but um you're in luck because if we go back here to these videos um hold on there was let me see if i go to my dashboard i know you guys can't see it but I'm looking at my dashboard on the other screen. I'm gonna, there's one video that has over 30 likes that qualifies for a giveaway. So I'm gonna do a giveaway right now. Um, where is it? Okay, I found it. Let me, let me find it over here. It is the giveaway for this video right here. How to easily make $100 a day trading Bitcoin with leverage. We have 31 likes. Boom. I just liked it again. 32 likes. All right, guys. So we're going to do a giveaway for this one. Let me see. Let's let's do it together here. So uh, usually I just go to Google. I put uh, YouTube comment picker. Here we go. Just need the URL, copy that, paste that, get comments, amount of unique commenters, 18. All right, here we go. You guys ready? Let's do this raffle. Here we go. Good luck, guys. Let's see what we get. And the winner is Vlad Apostle. Let's see what, what your answer is. The price that is good stop loss. The price that is a good stop loss is a little bit lower than the lowest candle of the day. Yup, Vlad got it. Thank you very much, Vlad. I know he was in my stream the other day along with his sister, actually. So congrats, buddy. I know you you uh, you you actually the one I think you pointed out that this one had the 30 or the 30. So it was just meant to be for you, huh? You must have known. You must have known this. So Vlad, uh, send us a DM on Instagram and we will get you set up in the trade room for the giveaway so there you go zay baba 11 um just answer your question just did a giveaway right now uh and we have giveaways going on for our other ones we just got to get them over 30 likes so uh get working on those uh dave francis 5277 uh dave he's asked a question before with his killer beard and glasses right there um he said where did where did you learn to trade uh dave i learned to trade uh on the internet really man um I watched a lot of videos online. I, um, you know, uh, made a lot of mistakes. Uh, that's another way I learned to trade. Um, and experience. Um, those are really the three main things. Uh, a lot of I watched a lot of tutorials online. Made a lot of mistakes, and just stuck with it long enough to get to gain enough experience to where um, now you know uh, I I started learning how to be profitable i started getting that discipline that it takes to be a profitable trader um so 
that's mainly how uh, other ways you can do it also uh, you could read books I did a lot of reading um, I did a, I, I listened to a lot of audiobooks so like when I would go to the gym when I would go for a run when I would drive around um, I instead of listening to music I was listening to audiobooks um, and uh, and I would read a lot of stuff online forums uh, group chats all sorts of stuff man so it's it's a uh, you got to accumulate all these things and kind of put them all together and that's kind of how I learned to trade <coughs> thank you for your question Dave appreciate you man um, next question we got invulnerable anants anants ain't it I don't know um, invulnerable with this looks like a filtered glasses I don't think those are real glasses are they but uh, this person says, I've been holding ETH since 101.65 on BitMEX. Should I hold or should I close my trade? Will ETH get to 1000 plus? Damn, you've been holding since $100 on BitMEX? At what leverage? And are the fees, how bad are the fees eating away at your position? So those are the questions I have. Because remember, you have funding fees every eight hours on BitMEX, um, which eats into your fees. Um, so um yeah I'm, I'm very curious at what leverage you're using how far up you are um and uh if you should close you should definitely be taking profits um and maybe buy actual ethereum like on a on, on a wallet some type of wallet or something and just hold ethereum uh yeah i definitely believe it'll go to a thousand uh but again it, it's correlated very heavily with Bitcoin so Bitcoin needs to continue going up in order for Ethereum to also get to that price level um, thank you very much for your question and I hope you answer because I'm very interested to know um, the leverage and you know the fees that you're paying to hold it since that price um, next question full pockets <coughs> full pockets sorry excuse me let me drink some water Gee. I was doing a lot of screaming yesterday. Watch the Heat game in case you didn't notice. Um, great game. Um, sorry if you're a Boston fan. Full Pocket says, um, sitting in this cool little area all lit up and stuff. I see you. Uh, what platform do you trade on? Uh, so I trade on multiple platforms, right? Uh, the one I was using before um, that I'm currently swapping over from is uh, BitMEX. I was on BitMEX for a while, uh, but they're now requiring KYC, so they're asking you for, you know, to prove who you are, to send documents over, etc., etc. Um, I don't want to do that, so I will be switching from BitMEX over to Bybit. That's where I've been trading recently. Um, and uh, I also use Binance, I use uh, Gemini, I use Coinbase, um, I use Qcoin. I've used a lot of different things, and I have funds in a lot of different uh, platforms I don't like to keep all my funds in one place um, so my funds are kind of everywhere all over the place um, but yeah those are the, the main ones that I uh, trade on depending what it is I'm trading depending if I'm using leverage or not um, yesterday I dropped a tutorial on Bybit if you are interested in it um, so you could definitely check that out um, and yeah that's pretty much it thank you for your question uh, Yusef, uh, look at Yusef over here on the beach, on the water, okay, I need to go to the beach right now, man, um, he said, what will happen to Bitcoin, gold, and silver after the pandemic is over, um, so I'm not sure, man, I, I really don't know, I can't predict the future, you know, uh, I, I believe Bitcoin will continue on its way up, as it's been going, um, before the pandemic, you know, uh, the last 10 years, Bitcoin was the best asset uh, to hold long term over the last 10 years. And there is no pandemic during that. Uh, I don't I don't see why uh, the end of the pandemic would change uh, anything for Bitcoin. Gold and silver, on the other hand, maybe uh, it might just kind of go flat again as it trades most mostly. Um, but for right now, with the pandemic plus the election coming, um, I think a lot of people should be sticking with Bitcoin, gold, and silver um, instead of having their money in the stock market. Um, I'm looking over my shoulder because the stock I have the charts from the stock market up right here. Um, 
it looks like uh, the Fed released some news that they're keeping the rates the same so stocks are going up a little bit um, but yeah um, yeah and that's the, actually the last question guys so that's pretty much it uh, I appreciate you guys real quick before we finish though before we log off I got the question of the day for you guys I got it here nice and ready uh, so as you guys know every video we'll ha we have a random question about something in the video question is always in a, is in a random area of the video find a question and find the answer post your answer in the comments for a chance to win a free month's membership to our trading room winners will be picked randomly once the video receives over 30 likes good luck guys so let's jump right to the question of the day if you have no knowledge on Bitcoin where can you find this information so this is one of the questions we got today and uh, this will be the question of the day post in the answers where you can find this information um, just so for other people that might come to the to the video you know and don't know too much about Bitcoin and they want to also learn about Bitcoin maybe they skip that part <clears throat> and they looked at the comments we'll have this information for them um, so that's pretty much it guys I hope you guys enjoyed the video uh, we'll have um, something else tomorrow so look forward to that and then we'll have a market analysis on Friday um, that's pretty much it guys thank you very much peace and love as always